EA Sports, it's in the game. There's no doubt about it now. This guy has to be in the All Madden team. It's the NFL on EA Sports as you take a look there at Lincoln Financial Field in Philadelphia, PA. Coming up, we've got a good matchup on tap between the Las Vegas Raiders and the Philadelphia Eagles. Here's the kicker, Jake Elliott, ready to get this one started. And off we go from Lincoln Financial Field. Fielded right around the eight. And he's going to be taken down inside the 10 at about the eight-yard line. One guarantee I can absolutely make is that all week in preparation, the coach kept telling his team, we're on the road, don't do anything to bring the crowd into it. And that's exactly what they just did. A bad return, and now the home team crowd, they are fired up. Oh. Car going to throw right away. And a quick throw here, that's complete. The game's first play produces six yards, brings up second down. Working from the gun, it's Carr. Catch is made by Hunter Renfro. And he's taken down, but not before he gets this across the 25-yard line. Now a first carry for Brandon Bolden. And this is going to be a Raiders first down as he'll take this up to the 38-yard line. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Carr with a play fake to Jacobs. Oh, that's into double coverage and intercepted. And the Eagles will have solid field position here as they take over at their 45-yard line. That right there is the inauspicious start that they were hoping to avoid the turnover on the first possession. I love how you use those college-bound words like that, inauspicious. Well done. I really appreciate that. Thank you. But here's the thing for me. And he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Now, following the sack, they'll look to make amends on a second down and 17. Hurt sets up to throw it. That's caught by the big tight end, Dallas Goddard. 
And he'll be taken down, but not before they work this to the 45. On first and 10, it's Hurts. This is Smith with a grab. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. And it's complete right back in the hands of Smith. And so close, he gets it to the one. Out of bounds right there. First and goal, a chance to convert that early turnover into points. They'll run with Sanders. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. A one-yard touchdown run for Miles Sanders. And the Eagles use the early turnover to get on the board first here in this one. So a great start. They force the turnover on the other side and then take it down the field on their first drive and finish it off with a short touchdown run. Nice and efficient. Excellent job blocking. He finds the gap and barrels into the end zone. Great way to finish off that drive. Hertz will throw. It's caught. And it's 8-0. So they like to pass there on the two-point try. Sometimes it can prove risky there at worked out. Yeah, and I love how you bring up that it can prove risky because if you get it intercepted and they return it, that's two points for the defense, but not on that play. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And a short kick taking it about the 16. And he won't quite make it to the 25. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. They threw an interception the first time they had the football. Wound up leading to a touchdown the other way. How do you approach drive number two? Going back to your game plan coming in, everyone has matchups that they like better than others where they think they have an advantage, dial up some of those plays. Try and go to those spots and get your offense moving. Play clock down to zero, and this is not the way to start a drive. That flag accepted, and it backs the offense up a little bit. So a little bit of a stiffer challenge now. First and 15 following the delay of game. On play action, it's Carr. That's caught by his tight end, Foster Moreau. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. First rep of the game for Josh Jacobs. And he's going to bowl his way forward to the 48. The last run got six, now second and four. Once again, it's Jacobs. And across the midfield, stripe into Eagle territory. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. Trying to run for it with Jacobs. And yeah, brought down, but not before he was able to break the tackle, and the extra effort moves the sticks. One quarter down, eight nothing the score. Three tight ends in the ball game here on first and ten. Now they'll throw with Carr. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Jacobs. And they're able to get this one past the 30 down to the 25. The Raiders going to use one of their timeouts. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. Here 
Here's Jacobs on first and ten. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. Car going to throw. Touchdown, Raiders! Darren Waller with a touchdown grab for Derek Carr. And the Raiders have come back to make it a two-point game. Good bounce back drive right there through the pick on drive number one. Drive number two leads them right down the field into the end zone. Agree totally. Excellent bounce back. Tremendous poise. Confidence never lost. And obviously he transmitted that to his teammates as well. What a really nice drive. So 8-8 our score now as he'll send this one away. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. A long drive last time out for this offense, Charles. If you remember, they started basically in the shadows of their own end zone, marched it down the field, and a lot of that was through the passing game. And partner, as a former defensive back, I've had almost a physical reaction watching what's happening right now, but let's give credit where it's due because they've done an excellent job moving the ball through the air. Secondary getting picked apart pass by pass. Obviously, they need to make some adjustments there on the back end. Yeah, because offensively, we know that they're not going to be shy about throwing that football. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and that's going to bring up second down. Second quarter, two minutes to go. Tie ball game. Three yards remain for second down. Check, check. Alert! Alert! Hurts a handoff to Sanders. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. Call it no gain that time as it's going to leave him with a third and about three to go. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Hurts. They'll get this one complete. That's A.J. Brown. And they're going to get this down near the 35-yard line. I don't care how many times we see it, I still get a kick out of watching quarterbacks and receivers do the pass trait in pregame warm-up. But I always remember that when we go to practices, we see that after practices as well. They really tune it up, don't they? They tune it up. They know why they do it for these situations. First down. And they build that trust, and that's why they're able to find him in this type of a situation. Tackle made there by Bilal Nichols. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. They'll fake the give to Sanders, and now Hurts. Smith brings it in, going across the middle. And he's going to have another first down as the tackle comes at the Raiders' 13-yard line. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense as they'll stop the clock with 24 seconds to go in this first half. But first down, Hurts. Connecting quickly with Goddard. And the Eagles are looking at first and goal as he's tackled all the way down at the two-yard line. Now the Eagles will use the second of their timeouts. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. They'll try to run with Sanders. And he's in for the Eagles touchdown. Miles Sanders as the first half is winding down. And the Eagles have taken the lead here in the final stages of this first half. 
The call from Nick Sirianni. Let's go for two here, he says. They'll try and throw for it. And that is incomplete. 16 seconds now on the clock. Well, split the difference, and they're right where they would have been with two PATs. They got the two-point conversion the first time they failed there. Interesting, isn't it? Because the first time you go after your first score, that feels like a gamble. The second time when they tried it again, that felt like, what the heck, right? Because, as you said, even if you miss it, you split the difference, and you're right on schedule at 14 points. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. And the ball backed way up. So thinking with this amount of time on the clock, probably just sit on it, and we'll see these two teams go to the lockers. Yeah, I don't think you want to overthink it in this situation. Either side of the ball, just go ahead and finish up the half and get on out and talk about it. On play action, now Carr. On the throw, led him too much that time. It's incomplete. And they approach this drive with a lot of confidence after the last one ended up as a touchdown. Incompletions on their first two throws. Has them huddling up and trying to figure out a big play here on third down to get their momentum going again. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. Darius Slay with a pick. And he will be brought down on what will be the final play of this first half. That's it for the first half. Two more quarters to go. We'll have plenty more to see after the break. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth ready for quarter number three. So the Eagles with the lead, and they're going to get this football first as the third quarter gets underway. And here comes a return from the middle of the end zone. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. at the line this Philly offense set to go this offense set to begin the third quarter and Charles if they had a checklist of things they wanted to accomplish in the first half certainly at the top of that list would be having the lead and they've got that here that's always the most important box to check isn't it but also they've had some success in their passing game so probably an empty box establishing the run they're on pace for fewer than 100 yards in this one so now they want to make sure that they get that going so they truly have a control in this ball game and down the stretch being able to be balanced either throw it or run it and try and win this ball game they'll throw on first down with hurts throw left side complete that's brown and this will leave him a yard short Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. From just shy of midfield, Hurts. He's got Dallas Goddard, his tight end over the middle. And they're gonna get this to about the 44-yard line. Many different ways to create space, but on that play, he did it with that big, wide body of his. Didn't get a whole lot of yardage on the play, but it did what it was supposed to, pick up a first down. On first and 10, it's Sanders. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. In the first half, he was held in check on the ground, but despite that lack of production, they still have the lead. Yeah, and they've got to feel fortunate about that. If they could actually get production from their lead horse, that would help open up this offense and widen this margin, too. Wide open is Watkins. He's got it. And he's going to have another first down as the tackle comes at the Raiders 21. A gain there of 21 yards. Here's Hurts to throw. It's caught. Smith. And he'll be marked down right at the 15-yard line. They go back to the ground with Sanders. And the reinforcements come in as they're going to stop him behind the line. And they'll be in search of six yards here on third down. This is now the ninth play of the drive. Smith catches left side. Touchdown! 
Devontae Smith on the receiving end from Jalen Hurts. And the Eagles take the opening kickoff of the third quarter and drive right down the field to extend their lead. They'll look to throw to the end zone, but knocked away and incomplete. I don't know about you, but I can't wait for a few years of two-point tries and see what the data tells us because a lot of teams want to throw the ball in this situation, this time unsuccessfully. I just wonder if maybe running the ball might be the way to go. With it moved up from the three to the two, you would think maybe a few more attempts at running. I, I think stats over time may bear out that running the ball will at least be the equal of throwing it in that situation. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. And their deficit a little wider than it was at halftime. Does that touchdown a minute ago change the thinking here at all? I think it does, at least a little bit, because now urgency has to start setting in. You can't go out there and go three and out and run the risk of falling behind substantially, but you have to do it without pressing, because pressing, that'll lead you into bigger errors. And nothing but green grass here, middle of the field. And he will score. Touchdown, Las Vegas. Mac Hollins, 83 yards. And the Raiders are able to get a score back in the final stages of this third quarter. And Charles, I had an offensive coordinator tell me one time that they designed every play to score. I don't know how true that is, but he had to run a long way after that catch. Heck of a play. I think that when he was telling you that, he was designing run after catch in every play. <laughs> I mean, that, that's the only way to put it in there, and that's what we got on that one. Nice catch, an even better run for big yardage. And he will get into the end zone to cut the deficit down to four. So they're able to throw it in for the two-point conversion. Sometimes that can be a risky play, but they got it. Yeah, you always have to be careful here because if you do get it intercepted, it's returned by the defense, that's two points for them. But he identified an open target and put it right on him. Following the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Carlson. Now this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And he'll be brought down shy of the 20, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone, not a good one. Ready? The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. Still enjoying the lead here in the third quarter, despite their defense giving up that last touchdown. Now they'll see if they can get the equalizer here on this drive. And he will finally be taken down, but how about that play? It's a big one on the final act in the third quarter. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. So the big play gets him across midfield now for first and 10. Another run with Sanders. 68 yards rushing for him now with a couple of touchdown runs to boot. Six yards on that last play. Here's second and four. They'll run with Sanders up the middle. And this time not quite to the 30. It'll be down at the 31-yard line. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Up the middle they go with Sanders. A gain of four last play. They double that here and get eight. Well, at this stage, that's exactly what you want offensively. Good run on first down. Stay in bounds. Keep that clock rolling. And look at that play chart that the play caller has in his hands right now. That's what you got to focus in on because that's divided up by sections. And right now, he's looking at that four-minute offense section. What running plays do we have to bleed down the clock and take care of the football? Right now, they're executing really well. It's a second down run with Sanders. And he'll get it down this time to the 17. 
Seven yards there at a first down. I think we're seeing the effect that runs like that are starting to have on this game. They're a little bit slower, that front seven reacting to the football, almost like body blows in boxing. Slow them down, and they're really starting to take over in this game. A give running left, it's Sanders. Eight yards on the pickup, and now they'll have some options on second and short. Able to stay in bounds, so the clock keeps rolling. This defense right now 